Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel again. In this video, I'll show you the Google AI Studio update, like how can you use Google AI Studio and what's the best practices and what's the best information you can use from Google AI Studio and how to use it and what tool are already there. You can use it from Google AI Studio. Okay. So you can see I already opened Google AI Studio updates and recent features and also all the information. So before I'm going to the topic, the main topic let me show you one of the tool that is helping businesses or their website SEO and others thing okay so if I go to the website you can see I already opened this website and you can see the website name is boostify and you can see I already mentioned here and my website is already there and if I show you in the recent blog post option you can see I have 42 posts and the last post was created 30 November and they are creating for me the blog title blog images and also they are focusing one keyword for each page for each blog okay and if you watch here you can see the action option like if i want to do some action like if i copy this like i can upload them manually then you can see from here okay and if i show you the optimized pages option like how many pages are already optimized you can see these pages are already optimized and I have 64 pages that are already optimized and they have the focus keyword for each page as it the main domain so that's why they don't have any focus keyword but for the other pages you can see they have all focus keyword for each page okay so now if I show you another option for this page then you can see here is the AI recommendation option in the AI recommendation option they have the information you can see I have already 102 monitored pages that's mean I have 64 already monitored by AI and also I have the recommendation for my SEO 35% and you can see the recommended fixes this tool will give you everything like they will analyze your information they will analyze your data correction and other thing and after that they'll give you the suggestion and also why you need to fix them manually they also give you the suggestion and why it matters okay and if you scroll down here you can see the title option in the title option i have already 64 title and out of 60 they already approved 21 and in the meta description option one they already approved one and out of 64 they have the already h1 and also how many images i have image title internal linking i have in my website they are showing to me so i am recommending you to use this tool for your website seo if you want to do a better result if you want to do a better explanation if you want to do a great ranking factors for your website then i am recommending you to use this tool okay so now let me show you the main topic that we are discussing on like google ai studio google ai studio means let me show you one by one so what is google ai studio google ai studio is a web based development and also environment IDE for building with google generative models and especially gmini and let's develop our prototype iterate generate test and deploy like you can use it for your whole thing like you have lots of tools in a bucket so you want to use them all exactly in the same time then you can use a mother website so that's mean the google ai studio is the mother website for each tools like nano banana bo3 flow whisk and also for the gemini okay and let me show you the google ai studio recent updates you can see they have the gemini 2.5 pro flash integration and also they have the agentic tools and also asins function calling and also they have the live api native audio and also the url context too and you can see the build deploy support system so you can use all the tools in a bucket like the bucket name is google ai studio let me show you one by one how google ai studio works if you search on google with google ai studio then you can see here is the first website it will be appears in the first line of google and you can see in this temporary chat you can see you can use nano banana from the google ai studio gemini 2.5 pro and gemini flash and also you can see there are lots of structure output for each code and each tool you can see there a run settings option if you click on this and if you click on this you can see the temperature and media resolution and also the structure information like everything you can set up once and after that you can use them for these features okay so now if you want to use nano banana then you can see nano banana will be added here but if you want to use nano banana in separately 
then you can see here is the nano banana site for nano banana okay but this is not from google here is the nano banana option if you click on this gemini nano banana then you can see here is the run option okay but for the ai studio they combine all the tools in a simple website you can see they have the gemini option live option images option audio option video option everything in there and you can see if you want to go to the dashboard option they have the dashboard api key and you can see all the import project here all project here kpi project here api project here and uses billings you can use all the tools in google ai studio for one subscription okay so i hope you understand about the google ai studio that's mean google ai studio is the mother of all tools like for gemini flow whisk and nano banana and others thing okay so thank you very much for watching i hope you understand about the google ai studio new update and everything you understand from me everything you are already got from me so thank you very much for watching let's see in the next video